Hello everybody, welcome to It's a Camping Thing. Yeah, have a laugh now. Oh, oops. Um, yeah, uh, I ordered a t-shirt, had a change of logo and thought, you know what, gonna have my own little, little kind of merchy thing. Trouble is, I didn't get the size right. Only arrived a little while ago, hence was a tag on the back, but yeah, I like the logo, but unfortunately I'm gonna have to reorder in another side because it was my fault. Nobody else's. Anyway, we're not here to talk about t-shirts or overgrown. It's kind of like a wingsuit, isn't it? You know, gust of wind comes through, I'm gonna be going. <sighs> anyway, yeah, we're here to talk about a nightstand, the Keshwa nightstand, and I've got it right here. Now, I picked this up last week when I was in Decathlon at Nottingham. I was there to go and pick up the MH100 three-person tent, and whilst I was there, I had a quick look around, saw this and thought, you know what? I really, really like the look of that. Now, I'm gonna give you the dimensions. Um, when it's when it's built up, because it is in its flat flat pack form at the moment, and it does actually use its own case as well. I have actually set this up before. So when it's set up, it is 30 centimeters high by 30 centimeters wide, and it is 26 centimeters deep. It has a max low capacity of four kilograms. So please do not think of this as a stool or a chair. You will break it. Um, it has an integrated carry bag. And yeah, folding volume, um, 31 by 20 by six centimeters. Anyway, I'm gonna show you how to set this up. Now, incidentally, I did use this earlier when I was using the Keshwa MH100 three-person tent. I had it inside the tent. Now, I like this because of one simple thing, and I'll show you that in a moment. So, it is flat packed. So we have two of the legs set them to one side and then we pull out the main part of it and there is there we go uh, you just slot them in really really simple there's a red end and a white end they are colour coded. So that is that part there. And there is a front and back. The front part actually has these pockets at the front. And then you've got this sort of deep section here which you can place valuables in. Now I like the idea of this because I need glasses. And if I'm gonna be sort of laying perpendicular to the a table, put my glasses on, chances are I could swing my arm out in my sleep and knock the glasses off, or maybe my GoPro accessories, I've got a lot of batteries and memory cards and that, I can put them in here. But this isn't the end of the assembly. No, 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 because the bag that it comes in, there's actually a couple of poppers at the back. And what we do is we just pop them on, just to line them up. That's one done. And then the other. And then we have a top for our nightstand. Now in here we can use a lantern of some sort, put that on there, maybe car keys, but this will not take a lot of weight at all. But if you wanna go inside to this part here, you can simply roll that back and have easy access to your contents in here. A couple of pockets along the front, one large one, which is, takes up about two thirds, and obviously the one third on the other side. Really nice, really simple design. And, so, and it uses the pouch that it all comes into as the top surface as well. I like it. I don't think it's perfect. I think it's good for what it is. This cost me £19.99. I wouldn't want to pay much more than that if I'm brutally honest. Um, the slats in this top section, they seem very, very delicate. And they actually did have a show model when I went shopping at Decathlon and somebody looks like it actually sat on it and actually broke it and it, yeah, it doesn't seem like the most strongest of materials at the top. So be mindful of that, of how much weight you do actually place on the top. But for me, I like it because I can put all my valuables into this area here and I know the fact they're not gonna get knocked off, and maybe lost in between a layer like a sleeping bag or something like that. And again, just to pack it all away, we just 
pull out the legs like so. There's red, those are the red ones, and then the white ones like that. Then this part then collapses. And then the top part, like I said earlier, we can then place everything inside that. It's a little bit of a tight fit, but it does, it does go in. So there we go, that is the Decathlon Keshwa nightstand. Uh, I will give you a few more details while I'm here. So from Decathlon's website itself is, comes with a two year warranty. And height, as I said, is 30 centimeters. Width is 30 centimeters, so about the length and width of a ruler. Depth is 26 centimetres. It is a multi-storage unit because obviously you've got that inner compartment and then the top part as well. Compact design, folded. Length, when it's folded, the length is 30 centimetres. The width is 20 centimetres and the height is six centimetres. Total weight is one kilogram, including the bag, which obviously you need for that top layer. Easy transportation. Uh, recommended for use, so this is directly from Decathlon's website. This bedside table is designed to store, organize, and protect your personal belongings and accessories on your campsite. You can place it inside your tent bedroom that you have required space. It is not waterproof and should not be used outdoors. The removable shelf also serves as a storage bag. You can put your phone or tablet down if you want to watch videos. The storage area and two pockets make storage easy. Yeah, it's a little tiny storage device for the side of your bed. And for me, with GoPros, I've got two GoPros that I'm, I use regularly. I want a place for all my batteries and all my spares and all that to put it in there, to keep it off the ground and away from the cold, which can be uh, quite draining on batteries. So to conclude, the Keshwa nightstand or bedside table, I prefer to call it bedside table, but you can call it both. And uh, you will find it on Decathlon's website. At the moment, it's retailing for around about 19 pounds, 99 pence, which I think is a about right. I really wouldn't want to pay that much more for it simply because it is really designed for campsite camping as opposed to bowl camping. It weighs one kilo. You can't take it outside. It's not weatherproof. So realistically, it has only got one purpose and that is a nightstand or bedside table. Now, um, I like it for me because it solves one particular problem, which is having expensive items, uh, maybe your wallet, your keys, your car keys, uh, GoPro accessories and all that, I can put them into this central location and I know the fact they're gonna be secure. It has happened to me, to me before, we've had a bedside table, just a normal kind of table that you would use for a stove or something like that, by the side of the bed, an arm's gone out, knocked everything flying and uh-oh, where has everything gone? This for me solves that issue. And if you have got things like glasses and that, it would be a good idea to put them in there in case that does happen to you too. Um, but who do I think it's really designed for? Well, I think it's really for people who are going campsite camping and adults only because this will not take much weight at all. So realistically, you're gonna have a, a lantern on top of there, and maybe your valuables inside. Um, but a child's gonna see that and think a seat. And when I did go to Decathlon, when I first saw this product, somebody had actually sat down on it and it had he had broken under the pressure. So realistically, I would say if you're going with kids, uh, either make sure they don't sit on it and they're fully aware of it or an adult only camp. Um, but yeah, I like it. It folds down nice and neat. It's good. For me, it solves a problem. Maybe if you've got valuables that you want to be at hand when you're at sleep at night, then yeah, it's going to solve a problem for you too. So yes, I do recommend it. Uh, it is only a first impressions. I will try this out when I go camping in the future. And then once I've tried it a few times, I will give you a full comprehensive review in due course. So that about wraps this video up. For those of you who are really keen and good sighted, you'll notice the fact that my, my t-shirt has shrunk. Well, actually it's, it's another one. I had to order another one because the one was too humongous and I didn't want to go flying away when a breeze of wind came along. So 
I want to thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, found this video in any way helpful, please consider liking, leaving a comment, subscribing, and sharing this video. Take care, and I hope to see you again soon. If you're out camping, have a good one.